Welcome everyone to a quick update for my SA Figure Arts collection for the MCU line as they just released the Falcon and the Winter Soldier figures. And since they just dropped the Spider-Man No Way Home trailer as well, I thought I'd show you some of my recent pickups, some of them kind of related to that film. And it's about time I will do a full collection of my MCU figures very soon since they're kind of moving on to the Phase 4 line. And I believe the last one I did was last year with the Infinity War Endgame. And since then I have picked up a fair few figures and of course I've done recent collections of certain characters. So the first figure I want to show you is the Spider-Man Far From Home Stealth Suit. And obviously it's exclusive to this movie only. And I believe it's because they just released the Medicom Mafex figure. So that is why this has dropped in price. So it's a good time to pick up this one if you're looking for it. And I'm still missing the original and upgrade suit. So I will pick those up once I see it, but I'll start off with this one since it was a pretty cheap price. And then the next one is the Endgame 4 Final Battle Edition. I do have the original 4 figure for Endgame, and I decided to go for this one because since I have the Captain America, Iron Man and Thanos Final Battle, I thought I had to pick up this version. Obviously, it's a big improvement with the lightning effects and also the alternate head sculpt. So adding them all together, you do have this really cool pose. So if you don't have the original version, obviously go for the Final Battle Edition. But if you have the original one, it's really up to you. But I thought I needed this one in my collection. And then we have another improved figure. It is the Avengers Infinity War Doctor Strange. And this is known as the Battle on Titan Edition. And obviously, improvements to the accessories, the cape as well, it is soft, and also get an alternate head sculpt with the eyes closed. And that's probably the main selling point for me, because you can do that meditation pose. And since the Far From Home trailer did feature Doctor Strange, it's probably a good time to pick up this version as well. So if you don't have the solo movie or the original Infinity War edition, then definitely go for this version. And then this was a surprising pickup. I didn't expect to, to see this for this price as it was 1500 which is about £150 which is actually a steal in today's market because I believe it's a lot more expensive and probably almost double the price so to see this brand new for that price I had to pick it up. It is Spider-Man in the homemade suit and obviously Iron Man the Mark 47. The homemade suit you can actually buy the solo edition but I believe that's pretty rare now as well. So the only way to get the Mark 47 is in this box set and this is quite iconic because it was in the Homecoming movie. I don't believe he's going to wear this in the No Way Home movie, maybe he will, I don't know. But obviously if you're looking for the Spider-Man homemade suit, this is probably your best bet, but for a high price. So yeah, really happy to have this box set as it's quite limited. And now we can move on to the first look of the Falcon and the Winter Soldier figures. Starting off with Bucky Barnes and kind of what I expected with the packaging, really nice. And a first look at the Bucky figure, obviously promo photo showed that the face sculpt wasn't the best. So we're going to have to take a look when I do the reviews. This figure does come with that shield and also a base, which is really cool. And it's the same for the main star, Falcon. A much bigger box obviously with the wings and promo photos show a different story because looking at this especially the ones with the goggles it's a big improvement to the infinity war figure and i think that face got looks fantastic i'm not too sure about the ones without the goggles obviously i'm gonna have to do the review as well and then from the back you also get the base and then obviously the wings in the flight poses so really excited to obviously pick up the phase four figures and next month they are releasing the Captain America John Walker as well as the Shang-Chi figure as well. So exciting times for the Phase 4 fans. And in the meantime, of course, you can check out some of my other videos I've done. And then stay tuned for the reviews of these two figures. Thanks for watching and hope to see you next time.